Hello. It's me again. My video was interrupted by a call from my people. So I am going to try to continue the video and see. So I am walking along the fence of the port where the big ships and bring the containers and all those type of things, imported materials. So my battery was low. But like I said, today I had a power bank. Got it recently. So I should be able to make longer videos. So all these houses that you can see here are houses that were built most of them or okay not most of them but these few ones were built during the colonial era so most of them are part of the UNESCO protected buildings these like this one and this so that's why when they get old, people don't destroy them. So they only reflection the, the, the deteriorated areas and then artifacts so these are logistic and shipping companies so today is Saturday that's why the place is less busy it looks empty like this normally on the other days when you come you see a lot of people walking in the streets and everything so kids probably live around here not very far so it's gonna be a little long walk yeah maybe a 20 minutes video the first one was interrupted by a call that I received from home. Yeah. This is the entrance of the port authority. So that's where the big ships are. Don't know if you can see them from here. I promise that this video is going to be less shaky, but I don't know if I can make respect the promise. <laughs> I almost forget that I have a tripod. It shouldn't be shaky. So, this is um, also an, an old building, probably protected by the UNESCO. It serves as a post office of the port so these are these are the the ships the big ships these are the big the ship that bring the containers Yeah. There's another building. Old building. 
that serves as a casino. This is called Casino de Port. It's a casino where people go to play money games and gambling and everything. I think they also have a, a bar and a restaurant inside and some type of discotheque where and a, town, a hall where people where they organize held certain events but I've never been there too so like here from here you can see the big ships here yeah so now we are going on the other side so the the streets are empty today Saturday very normal thing <laughs> yep okay this right here is an art gallery is the biggest art gallery of the country here okay like this also is an ancient an old building like you can see probably protected by the unesco as you can see it is in not inhabited and uh, they, it is not destroyed too so maybe they will refection it later and then put use it as some type of office or something they usually don't destroy them so this is the art gallery there Okay, let me cross now. That's a Shell Shell gas station. It belongs to French. I don't like that. Anyway, so this is the central bank where all the many money is made from. This building is also part of the central bank building. It is an old building built in 1972 by a Senegalese architect and uh, called Pierre Atepa Gujabi. This is the place where the money is made, is kept maybe. And there's another one that I showed on the other side in my another one of my videos. That one is part of this that's where the headquarters is the offices this is the actual bank this one is the actual bank so in 1972 it used to be the tallest building here but now there's more buildings as tall or even taller than this one That's where I have bought this 
of my shirt and the short that's where I bought them and this is the post where I recently I came to take my um, letters and mail so maybe you don't know it here they don't deliver the letters if you have a letter they put it in your mailbox you have to come yourself and get it so when you are so you have to come from time to time to check it if you have mails so this is the bottom this also is an old building part of the UNESCO protected buildings so so I go yeah now I am heading to the center so most of the buildings here uh, office buildings they, so, they are office buildings most of them and shops and shopping centers and uh, just a business center and uh, a lot of offices government offices it used to be a place where people live but then after independence people have started delocating relocating to the other places market I've never been here before let me go see. I've never entered the market before so, So, so you huh? God, people don't like filming. I just wanted to show the place. It's a lot of vegetables and fruits. Okay, now I'm going out. Salam alaikum. This is the, so the art gallery. The, it's a place where they sell artistic, a lot of crafts, handmade crafts. So, handmade craft. Okay, I'm out now. Walking again. Hope my phone is not gonna be full. Wow, Alpha. Okay. This is like an open gallery here. They sell handmade crafts, statues and all them things. Beautiful. 
A lot of beautiful stuff. Yep. These are for sale. Still me walking in the streets of Dakar, trying to make a good a video, a good one. Yep. Check now. Now we are going to head to the Independence Square. which is almost like the center of the city. The center of the center of the city. Construction workers. Huh. You know, it's funny. I was I was planning to buy a professional camera. But when I look at the quality of these videos, I wonder if it's necessary to buy a camera. Because maybe all I need is a, a nice, beautiful, um, how do you call it, software that I can use to edit all these videos because they look like they are quality videos to me okay let me cross yep so this right here is a ministry of Foreign Affairs is also an ancient building, an old building protected by the UNESCO. So, but these other buildings are built after independence. Yes. This place is called Place de l'Independence, which is the Independence Square. It's almost like a memorial for the people who have fought uh, in the name of the country. Those who have fought for the independence and those who have fought for uh, trying to defend the country in any type of war, any type of, uh, I don't know, war or peacekeeping missions. It's all the same. So, let me head on to this side. This is 
where I come from. Try to cross. Yep. A lot of street vendors. 